space station. He's got the wrong shirt. Oh. I guess you're right. They're just choosing the maps now. What does the Curly Joe play? Uh, no, it's not Curly Joe. Wait. It's, it's oh. Black. I'm bad, it was Curly Joe earlier. Wait, really? I'm, I'm dumb. Okay, I know what Zabadak plays. Lucino. Yes, I know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Might be a little bit of a tough game for uh, Bola. Yeah, Lucina has a long sword, so she can eat the two ICs at the same time. Wow, even King DDD can't eat both ICs at the same time. Yeah, but it's easier for Lucina. No, but I mean, King DDD like literally eats them. Both? No, he eats only one. It would be like scary if he ate both. Ah, Bullet needs to go to bed. Look at him, yawning. This is probably gonna be one of the most hyped matches. Everybody in the venue should be watching this right now. I don't know why they're not. Bunch of, like, lazy people. All right, let's see what the map pick is here. I'm kind of excited to get going for this one. So, it's Isis versus Lucina. Should be. Uh, oh, that's right. They have Pokemon Stadium One now because Pokemon Stadium Two is out of the map set. Yep. Did you know? Fun fact. I'm ready. I'm so ready. No, what's what's your fun fact? That Pokemon Stadium Two is no longer. Oh, oh, I thought he was going. Okay. I thought he was going for Sheik, dude. Feels bad. I would have loved to see the Bola Sheik, but here we go. Bola, Jab Black, Ice Climbers, Lucina, game one. Let's get it. Yeah. I'm hoping to see uh, Zero to Dead. Even for Lucina. Oh, Nana already taking some big damage from side B. Oh, good side B. Keeps Lucina out. Now getting a string of up airs going. 58%. Yeah, that's what happens when you hit both hammers. Just wait till he goes solo bow, though. Solo bow's about to take lives and sign names. That side B has a surprising amount of not lag. I mean, like it should. It feels like it should lag more than it really does. Uh, it's it still lags for a bit. You can punish it. No, he didn't, didn't do it right there. So he tries to go for the side smash out of the parry, but Bola manages to drift away with the like. The ending frames of a side beat. Okay. Bull's Ice Climber is still making it back here. Bola is starting to get a kill percentage. Zeblack gets a big read. Could be dangerous. Nice back air though. Sends Popo off stage. Separates Nana. Popo's still there. I thought he was dead. If Popo was dead, that, that's it. Wait, which one is he playing? He's playing Nana. Oh, my bad. Well, now I'm going to be confused the whole set now. Thanks, Bola. Now he's gonna need Popo to come back for him. Yep, nice. Gets, the, gets him back. He uses the side B to remain alive. Before there, doesn't kill yet. He will soon though. Both now kill percentage. I sees a little bit more. Just needs one nice up air here. Nice, he uses the side B, catches it, but oh! oh nice. And you'll see, uh, Bola is really good with Sopo. I can't wait to see that. Air dodges to ledge. He's getting kind of uh, camped out here. Although he makes it back on, this could be interesting. Oh, yeah. Up yeah. tilt. I mean, no matter how good you are at Sopo, that you can't do anything about that. Here we go. Let's get an up air strength going, Abel. Eh, but here we go. Both characters kind of poking away at each other now, not doing really much. What, what does Bola need to do in this matchup here better than he's been doing already? Grab more? Yeah. Every time he comes with a side B and Diablo like just shield it, so grab. I know your grab, your trolls are bad, but at least it's percent. You cannot let Zia Black really shield. Which is what he's doing and allowing him as well. 
Not recovering to ledge, unfortunately. It did look pretty hard for him to do that. Yeah, Black kind of running away with this game right here, although Popo freezes him, which allows him to rack up some nice damage. He's going to die here okay, with a few good hits. Although with Rage, Jab Black is going to hope to build up some percentage. Oh. Second stock to with Force Smash, I think, right? Out of shield, yep. Good option. Takes into account the lag time. Here oh. we go. Infinite. Oh. Uh, yeah, he almost got a desync there. Unfortunately, not quite. Don't usually get that in bracket anyways. I'm sure he has before though, with the amount he plays this character. Oh, he did, he did, yeah. Now Bola hoping to close his game out on Zeblack. Zeblack though, Bola at 96%, he is at kill percentage. It looks like his Popo might die, but he comes back with a side beat just in time to move the Lucina. Now Lucina off stage, Zeblack makes it back, however. This is so close. Oh, he misses oh. the edge guard, but is Popo dead? No, he's not. Oh, insane DI from Bola. Gimps him with the neutral beat. That's gonna be it, though, I think. No, it's not. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's good, he's good. Oh. <laughs> nice back air. Yeah, Black closes out game one. Very close game. I, I expect to see a bounce back from Bola. He's not gonna be switching off Ice Climbers, we know that. Yeah, maybe you will see uh, Zia Black's cheek. I don't think Zia Black has any reason to switch here. I think he knows he's capable of winning as we'll Lucina. No, oh. he definitely can, but... Maybe he was expecting for a two stock, which he didn't get, so he's like gonna switch to Sheik to try. But that's not the case. But you're not you're not Jared Zeblack, so you have no idea. We don't know what goes through his head. Alright, game two here, Zeblack up 1-0. Bowl's gonna look to make a comeback like yeah, he, he seems to be playing a little bit nervous almost. Yeah. Zia Black is just like one of the best players to adapt, so. Bola misses the back here. Zia Black read it, even countered, but unfortunately Bola didn't connect, so Zia Black got a little unlucky there. <coughs> Good stuff from Bola here. Starting to rack up the damage. Gets a nice back air. Oh, is that it? No. Okay. It feels like he's playing nervous. Like there's a lot of things that he would usually be getting that he's not getting. He still has the lead. Nothing to be worried about yet. Well, there's a lot of things to be worried about when you're playing against yeah, Black. But that those smash attacks out of shield seem to be working for him a lot more than they should be. If Dia Black keeps attacking him on shield with unsafe aerial, then it's free. Okay, now, Bola is gonna try to rack up percent. Uh, that's gonna do it, 53 percent. Yeah, Black with a nice falling uh, back air. Although, Bola opts to go for the side B there. I don't think Dia Black was ready for that. He was expecting him to wait to get Popo back. However, now he kind of caught him off guard. Oh, try to jab blood. <laughs> Unfortunately, the Ice Climbers RNG kind of comes in there and he only faces one way. I don't know if that's luck or if that's just a terrible character. <laughs> well, those aerials are so strong, that sword covers so much space. The bullet cannot do anything. Oh! Again, an unsafe attack on shield allows Bola to get a, a side smash that almost takes out Zeblack. Luckily for him, he managed to DI and survive that. But now Bola's getting a little bit of pressure because he has to close out this stock. Or else Zeblack is going to keep building a percentage and making the comeback. Yeah. Oh! Okay. Oh, he had to jump. He had to jump. Yeah. This is super dense. Oh. Super tense and a little up air. He's gonna take that second stock. Bola now up one stock. He's gonna have to get some damage on Zablack here if he wants to make this uh, lead worth any of it. Oh, there you go, oh. Bola. Nice DI. 
still living, although Popo is dead. Now, Solo Nana. I don't think he's making it back from this. Yeah, I'm not gonna ledge guard this for sure. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he, he had to do that. He had no other option. So Bola goes into this last stock with a 40% lead over Diablai. Let's see if he can make it work. It's already 61% lead, so it's, it's not nothing. Oh, so I'd be in two back here. We know though, with Lucina, Diablai can make up that percentage pretty fast. I'm pretty sure Popo is at like 40 or something. Yeah, he's taking a lot of hits. This is bad, this is bad. No, managed to get it back. He recovers high, and now he's using Popo to help him make it back. He's gonna make it back on stage, although he gets knocked off by that forward air. Diablak has the lead now. Bola looking for a big read, gets a dash attack, sends him up. Now both characters back in neutral. Oh. Diablak finally offs for a safe aerial on shield. Bola comes back on stage. Yeah, Black sends him off again with another back air. This could be the oh, end of the Ice it. Climbers. Yeah, that's it. And there it goes. Yeah, Black 2-0 over Bola. Close game though. Yeah. Could have gone either way. You look at the score and you're like, oh, easy win.